So hello everyone, I'm Shreyst. I'm a software development engineer. So uh, we are starting with this lead code premium top interview problem series. We'll be discussing each and every problem which are mentioned on the lead code top interviews. And also this will help you to crack your next coding interview in the top notch product based company. So let's start with the problem. So hi everyone, uh, today we'll look at this problem, sum root to leaf numbers, okay. So what this problem says, it says that you have been given a root of a binary tree containing digits from 0 to n, okay, and we need to find a root to leaf path from 1 to 3, okay, represents the number 123. How? See, at this point, what is the level? Level is 0, okay. So we have one more node at its left and one more at its right. So 10 will be multiplied with this. Okay, what I mean to say is that if we will, if I am having this tree, okay, so for this tree, what will be the answer? It will be 1 into 10 plus 2, 1 into 10 plus 3. These are the both root to leaf paths root to leaf paths okay so i'll have just have to add both of them so 12 plus 13 will be 25 so we will make use of normal depth first search here in order to solve this problem and how will we do it we will use the pre-order traversal technique okay so for this first we will do some calculations then call the left and the right child. okay so let's try to code it and it will give you a better insight how to solve this problem okay so what i'll do i'll just create i'll just make int sum is equals to zero okay i'll just uh, check for the base condition if root is equals to null what i'll do i'll just return zero else i'll just multiply s 10 plus root dot well correct else not equal to root of this will be this will be left and not equal to root of right and this will be what we'll just return our answer because now we have reached the leaf return some else we'll return some numbers root of left comma sum plus the same thing for right so this will be a code okay so what we did we did a calculation and we did a traversal like pre-order we just checked it for that if both of them exist and we just so i hope you have understood this problem okay so both the time and the space will be linear according to the number of nodes okay and uh, that's it this is a very important problem it has been asked multiple times in facebook now known as meta so do try to submit it using the same logic and do like share and subscribe this video thank you so much